Hey folks, got another epic adventure. Well, it's been raining for about uh, three days, almost going on four. Um, kind of dug out some more buckles I wanted to kind of share with you and talk about some of our collections, some of them we've dug. Um, they're pretty cool in my opinion. First one, which you can probably recently oh. seen that one. I think that was from the 40s. That was a uh, silver. It says turn silver. Belt there. And there's one that wife dug. Missouri. There's one I dug. It's silver uh, uh, plated and over copper. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty cool. And then here's something that went on the belts for cinching. Oh, here's this one here that uh, you probably recognize that one. Civil Wars. I oh, still got the piece in there. I haven't tried to knock it out yet. That's pretty cool. That's a piece of what I went with it. Um, let's see here. Here's another one. They would have had a, another prong just like that right there. If you can see that at all. I mean, you can see that better. The belt would have slid through there. Of course, this is the one uh, my wife dug. It's the puppy paw. So it's been uh, pretty rough. Uh, here's another one of the um, Model T. I don't know if you can see that. Like I said, some of these are just out of my collection. Some of these, well, like, like I said, we, we've dug them. I thought that's pretty cool. I mean, it's a neat little, little plate there. Here's a good one here. It's your Model A. This is an advertisement that they put on the buckles for 750 bucks uh, back in the day there. That's That's pretty cool. Um, uh, here's one um, it says an arc signal Vincessa Vincessa that's it so some of you may know what that uh, that meaning is here's one that uh, I got last year um it's a Jack Daniels whiskey. It says sire and mash. Uh, right down here in 1904. Right there, 1904. So, that's pretty neat. Heavy, really heavy. Yeah. Then here's the one that I uh, also want to talk about. This is a pilgrim belt buckle um you know, you know this area flat right here you can see where the um the pin was um yeah that's just that's super cool i mean to get one of these not an easy easy task by any means yeah, that's probably one of my favorites right there. Of course, my Civil War belt buckle is not here. I gave it to my dad. Then over here, I got some more I want to show you. Um, just, you know, all the different, all the different uh, suspender pieces. The different buckles. 
you know, the tether would have went through there or belt something to cinch down with some of these I went through and you can see I tumbled them they came out really good haven't decided to take that off yet or not but uh, yeah some of them are suspender pieces and you can some of them silver Look at that thing. Isn't that cool? So. Here's another suspender clip. And then, like I said, a lot of these, when they look really good, that's cause, just because I've, I've tumbled them. Some of them I haven't yet. Some of them have writing there. Trying to read that one myself. Yeah, I can't quite make it out. So, there's one dry. Here's my second one. <clears throat> and then here's silver plated. That's a suspender. Yeah, let's just look down here and you can see them all. Here's a gold plated. That's pretty cool. There's another one's pretty ornate. I had to tumble that, get her to shine up like that. Some of them, when they turn green like that, I'll just leave them. Here's another tray of them. Another suspender. That's a fancy quite a rig there. That thing's big. Now these are the clip the uh, clamps for the garters. And you can see some of them are um silver uh silver plated. Oh, this one still has a piece of leather in it. I don't know if you can see that very well or not. That's pretty cool. Oh, here's another one right here. This one's pretty good size. I'm trying to see it. It says Aspen Pat. Yeah. Here's another one that I tumbled up. I cleaned up really nice. And there's some kind of like this one that. Oh, damn it, come out of there. I really don't want to put in the tumbler. And then of course the uh, <clears throat> this was for the saddle. It would have been the the cinch in the front on a horse. And uh, that was probably uh, Civil War era. It's kind of hard to date them because, as uh, I recall, they're still being made to, today. Um, 
There's another one there. It's got some writing. Yeah. Can't tell if it's writing or just design. So. But yeah. And I've got some that are just super small. And probably kids had on dolls or something or yeah that one's really unique it has more like a hand or a lid but Pretty neat stuff. Pretty neat stuff. Huh. Really enjoy this. This one's also got a piece of leather in it. If you can see that or not. Right there. That's leather. This one's kind of... Pretty fancy and funky. I, I don't... I don't know why you'd need all that. Or maybe it's not a buckle. I'd... So, it... usually when they come out of the ground, they're old enough. They're, they're going to turn green. But if they don't turn green on me and I can clean them up, well, I'm going to run through that tumbler. Alright, well, thanks for watching. Check back later and like and subscribe. Later, y'all. Thank <laughs> you.